ladies and gentlemen. So, um, we got some teasers today. I'm sorry, I got home from work and I ended up falling asleep, woke up, took a shower. Here we are. I did see this throughout my day on my timeline uh, as like the little teasers and stuff. I haven't seen all of them. I've seen this one, the official one. And I'm going to give you guys my thoughts and everything as we're seeing this. Uh, we're going to check out the website, I think, first of all. Um, so it all started today. Charlie Intel tweeted about this as well. Usually they're one of the first people to do it. But there's a new website, thetruthlies.com. Now, this seems to be the first official teaser for... Oh. We got volume. We got volume and it's loud, ladies and gentlemen. But... As you guys can see, it's like you can you can change channels. You'll get different teasers. Uh, so we're going to check out this teaser, uh, if you will, together. So let me go ahead and put some volume. We'll start off with with uh, channel one. So this is channel one. As you can see, they're kind of going with a POV teaser of people making their way up Mount Rushmore. And so when I first saw this, I was like, this is actually crazy. Like, I really like... Treyarch always does a fantastic job with their teasers. This one more so feels like a classic Treyarch-style teaser. Like, even before the most recent games. So, pretty cool. So, yeah, they... I like how they did it, and it feels live-action. They got the Black Ops logo, the True Flies, and they're blinding the the forefathers or whatever and you can pause it apparently i didn't even know you could pause it we'll lower the volume a little bit but you can record one can you record oh you can download it too that is kind of crazy what yeah if you hit record you just download it channel one you can record what about power oh Oh, that's actually kind of dope. But yeah, so you can see this. So that was the first teaser. This was the first official one that I saw. So let's go to the next channel. I think they uploaded or did the second one now. Another kind of real life shot. Someone's putting up posters, putting up some glue. I have not seen this one. The truth list. Oh, they're using the same, the same thing of Mount Rushmore. But I think it's going to be like, you know, our forefathers, the founders of the country saying how the government's lying to you. At least that's what it seems to be. So we'll go ahead and download that one too while we're at it. That's channel two. I don't think channel three is officially live yet. Looks like there's going to be, oh wait, hold up. Channel six has got something. The truth is the first, let me see that again. We'll pause it. Monuments worldwide defaced on the right side of truth. News six breaking news. The truth is the first casualty of war, which I mean, honestly, that is kind of true. I mean, we saw what happened recently with what was happening in the Middle East. I haven't, I, I've tried to kind of put that to the back of my mind, mostly because it's gotten to the point where it's just like, it's, it's a loss of life, but one of the things that you did see that was kind of crazy was the propaganda on both sides uh you know you, you would get a report so and so building w blew up and then one side would say no this was the other side they did it and then they'd be like no they were launching a missile and it misfired so honestly that is true one of the first casualties of war is the truth you start getting kind of what the narrative what they want you to have as the narrative of it so Continuing on. So we got the logo. Die, war, hit, looked. Liberté, égalité, duplicate. In lies we trust. Looks like we got a, a whole... You might. This might even just be like different locations that are going to be set for the campaign. So we'll definitely see Statue of Liberty. The... I don't know. The, the, I know that's in DC. This one's also in DC. Maybe these are all, all four of them set in DC, but pretty interesting. So it looks like we got six channels. Three of them have stuff so far. It lets you download even though 
They don't have anything on there. I'm going to see if I can find anything on those off camera, but that was pretty cool. So if we go back to Charlie Intel, they posted kind of the video, the full one. We also have the new teaser that happened. This was an official blurred image that was released by Bibli Kuhn. And um, it looks like it's the official logo, dog. That's literally what it looks like. So if we go over to this guy, private investigator, exclusive gaming tech uh, deals and news. I'm not an insider, I just grab info for myself. But for those who didn't understand yet, I'm not, I'm the one who blurred intentionally to cover you know what, just like I did for Modern Warfare 3 one. And of course, I won't leak the unblurred cover. Interesting. So that's, that's what it is, ladies and gentlemen. Um, I think that might be it for right now. Channel 2, yeah, we already did that one. And then Channel 6, Channel 1. And that's pretty much what we got right now, boys. The teasers. I wanted to make a video reacting to some of the teasers we got today, some of the info. I'm pretty pumped up. This is going to be finally one of the first Call of Duties in a while that had a longer development cycle. So I am very excited to see it. I really hope more than anything that the zombies returns to form. I just, I could care less for Black Ops Cold War. I didn't like it. I didn't like the second half of Black Ops 4. Uh, I know this story probably was cool. I didn't even, I even fell off on the story. That's how bad it got for me. When they started doing the remakes of the other, I like, I, I like remakes, but as part of the year of content, I was like, they could have released that later on. Um, so that's why I was a little bit bummed out and kind of, I don't, I don't even know what happened in Cold War. I was, I just didn't care uh, with Cold War. I don't know why I didn't, if it didn't feel, once they started doing like weird operators and not actual characters like that you play as, I just didn't care anymore sadly so i'm really hoping they're able to do something different with zombies specifically for black ops 6 we'll see but anyways thank you so much for watching hopefully you guys enjoyed the video if you did drop a like if you're new make sure to subscribe with notifications on so you don't miss a single upload and if you want to support the channel directly you can do so by checking out my sponsors control freak and aim controller i use them every single time i play Photo GX rays get you a discount link in the description below to that or through my Amazon influencer page if you guys would much rather do it that way. I do know Control Freak is going to be having some downtime towards the end of this month while they're doing maintenance on their website. So check them out while you can right now. Koto GX rays get you a discount. I use them every time I play. And then if you guys want to talk and interact, at OGX rays over on Twitter, give me a follow over there. I usually talk and I'm up on there. So give me a follow. I'll see you guys next time. Take care. I'm out. Peace.